Welcome to another update from the 4th to 13 currently on the screen. It's a look at Tokyo's uh, railway uh, system. This was recorded about six hours ago. And the Japanese Meteorological Agency uh, continues to uh, monitor the tropical storm Yagi and Libby and have reintroduced some warnings for the Japanese region. This is the latest from the Joint Typhoon Warning Centre. They have issued a tropical cyclone formation alert advisory for FS 96W. When we did our live streaming uh, earlier today, you know, they had taken, they had actually uh, cancelled the advisory. It's currently located 164 nautical miles west southwest of Hong Kong. Animated multispectral satellite imagery depicts a partially exposed low level circulation with flowing convection displaced to the rest. Animated radar imagery indicates multiple low level rain bands wrapping tightly into a defined low level circulation over water. A satellite imagery shows weak. Deep convective banding wrapping into the low level circulation and service observations along the case indicate northwesterly winds of 15 to 20 knots, sea level pressure near 994 millibars. Upper level environment is favourable for development with good divergence aloft and moderate vertical wind shear 10 to 20 knots. As mentioned, the Centre has reissued a tropical cyclone formation alert for 96W. We will continue to monitor the various uh, systems and updates will be posted. Now this is the first track chart from the Joint Typhoon Warning Centre on Invest 96W. Ninety six W twenty one decimal one degrees north, one one two decimal three degrees east, twenty knots central pressure nine ninety two. This is the NOAA floaters on FS ninety six. Now, tropical storm Miyagi twenty six decimal six degrees north, one twenty three decimal seven degrees east, it's thirty five knots and central pressure nine eighty eight and leapy. 22 decimal 8 degrees north, 142 degrees east, 60 knots, 986 central pressure. And here's the Japanese Meteorological Agency on the uh, two tropical storms. This is the current chart on, I think it's Sleepy. And this is the NOAA floaters. The NOAA side is actually having technical issues, the fluctuation in the imagery. And this is on Leapy wind shear. The shear tendency. And since our live broadcast earlier today, the 850 millibar vorticity has actually changed. It's looking more healthier for uh, Leapy and 96W. That's it 
for, from uh, Force 13 and stay tuned for further updates. You can follow Force 13's outlets, the website force13.com, which has had a revamp and is still under reconstruction, but take a look. Also, YouTube, of course, if you haven't subscribed, that might be a good idea. Visit Force 13. We're also on Facebook under the same name, of course, and you can like us on there, and you can also follow us on Twitter. Search Force 13 all in text for those. You can also add Force 13 on Skype or my personal account on Discord, Fool13 at extension 9094.